That is amazing. Absolutely, that's, that is one of a kind. Superb. <laughs> you just rest across like that. Is that the idea? Yeah. <laughs> so it's ready. It's always ready at a moment's notice. It's ready to bungle. <laughs> to another episode of Bungle Collects. So Lady M and I, you've been to the Royal Mint. Is that our fourth time now, Lady M? Is it four times? We went October, November, December. January. January. And now March. Yeah, because January, we went January and February, didn't we? We did two, two tours in a row. Yes. So it's our fifth actual time. Is it Jan October, November, December, January, slash February, March. Fifth time. So we went down, met the whole bunch of guys down there, coin tubers, fans of the channel, subscribers. Absolutely amazing. This is what we got. We've got our Strike Your Own. We've got one each with a Megalosaurus coin. Those of you that have seen a, a previous video, was it PO Box opening? I think it was. I've already got this in bunk. got it from Change Checker and cut it open and freed it from <laughs> its cardboard prison. So I will not need to touch this one. You'll be, you'll be pleased to know. <laughs> so there's the, there's the coin. In, cheers. Hi, there's the coin in close-up. Packaging's absolutely amazing. So it opens up there. There's some information for you to... Have a have a read. Pause it and have a read. Should you want to? I haven't actually read it myself. Does it normally say that? And flip it open, so you can write. Yeah, the I struck your coin. Yeah, yeah. It's cool. on every, every packaging that, that I can that think before. of. Anyway, certainly the standard one. Yeah. And there's the denominations uh, information on the back there. So feel free to have a look at that. So we've got one each. Fabulous. So let's get on to the real interesting stuff. So it's not uh, as if coins aren't interesting enough. Where do we start, Lady M? Oh, I don't know. So we had a great time there, didn't we? We did some live stream. We met some wonderful people, uh, and people give us some wonderful, wonderful stuff. I, I honestly don't know where. I don't know where to start, lady. I'm going to just pick Maybe something. Maybe start with the things that we got first. So I think it would have been that. Ah, yes, we were. Yes, we did. So Christopher very kindly gave us a a badge each. We met Christopher on the Friday, didn't we? For we some did. Drinks. We met him in the uh, in the hotel. In the so um, are you ready for me to say it? Go on then. Magnumanity. Wow. Are you impressed with that? I am super impressed. Magnumanity. It was not just a fluke. So we got a badge each of there. It was absolutely, it was badge fest, wasn't it? It because was badge -arama. We got them off Christopher. We got these off Purple Fairy. One each of these. Absolutely fantastic. Of course, we had our own bash of bringing some badges. So we brought some, well, quite a few different ones. We've only got these two different designs left. One with Plum Finds on and one with Bungle Collects on. The Team Bungle one went amazingly well they, they'd yeah. all gone the one with just team bungle on team lady m badge eventually went uh, <laughs> and there was also a bungles cocktail stick as well wasn't there so yeah. there's only four of them they were they were pretty exclusive Super so four rare. people four lucky people got them so yes we got we that also... i think gordon well gordon was first wasn't he we, we, we saw gordon yeah. so gsa wolf coins we saw him on the way in. he came outside as we were walking in and he gave us both a pin badge with mutley on so those of you who don't know no why i'm not quite sure why he got that no no well those, well <laughs> people who don't know why you got the, the motley badge oh, you need to go oh, back yeah, and watch yeah. a couple of other other videos i think that was just saying to uh for, for lady m's benefit oh I mean, fingernails dirty lady i've got to clean the fingernail again Honestly. why does it get so dirty i don't know so gordon give us that so we met gordon and elizabeth so thank you very much for spending some time with us and coming down to see us Gordon didn't disappoint again with his pieces of eight. So we've already got a couple, didn't we? We've already got yeah. two. And he was able to... I don't think he ever went in this bag with a lady. Is this, is this uh, one of no, our bags? No, I, I, I think I put them in there. I can't, I can't open them. it. Do you want to open it? Yeah. While I eat, if you don't mind. Just while I try and clean that muck out my nails. It just looks so horrendous close up. So... Were they silver or gold last time? Uh, silver. Ah, so this time we've got some... Two gold and one silver pieces of eight. Oh, what's one side? And what's the other? There we go. Awesome. Yeah, I've got the nail brush out there and cleaned the thumb. That's the uh, that's the, the main thing. Met Steve from Leicester. So Steve from Leicester was very very kind to give us this two pound coin. So all cool design, that, the isn't older it? style two pound. Yep, United Nations for Peace, nineteen ninety five. Thank you very much, Steve from Leicester. Those of you that don't know Steve from Leicester, he is 
absolute, well, if Christopher had a leaderboard, uh, Steve would absolutely be at the top of it for all the one P's of the I'm year not, 2000. That, I'm not uh, sure he's actually on the board. I think he's actually ex got like his own little extension on the top of oh, the board. Oh, he is the board. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So big thanks to Steve from Leicester <laughs> for giving us uh, for, for giving us that. Who was uh, who was next? Probably would would Matt be be next? Because we've got Raftree, but there's that much from Raftree yeah, that have to do, do do that one. Yeah. So Matt from Coins and More UK, give us a sticker rock each. So this is Skegness Rock. That's where Matt yeah, hails fun. from. So we met Matt, and was it was it Oliver? Was it Oliver Matt's son who did a coin note with us? Terrible with him. So big mm. shout out to Oliver yeah. as well. He did yeah, really well. Oliver. If you haven't seen that, have a look at the live stream from the Mint Part Part Two. I think Oliver was in. He yes, did. Uh, he did amazingly amazingly well let's go with raft tree so are we sitting okay. comfortable everybody so we got this exclusive key ring there's all raft trees details for all your coin tuber needs and on the back there royal mint coin tuber meetup 7th of march 2020 so you give us one of them he also give us four of our own uh, key rings so it was very kind of him to bring these down i, I assume he's He'll be selling these on his uh, on his website. So if you want an exclusive Bungle Collects keyring, go to raftree.co.uk and you'll get. I'm sure you can you can purchase them. I didn't actually ask him that or how much they were. I guess he was just giving us some samples, but uh, I'm sure they're there to to be seen. We got this is this is cool. So as you know, we're doing a Bungle Collects on tour. So we weren't necessarily planning to meet anybody on the tour, and I don't want to give too much detail around it. Something Lady M are going to be and I are going to be touring the UK on a particular mission and then we'll be uploading a series of videos as we do it not sure whether we're meeting up with anybody you're not not quite sure we're there but if we are then uh raftree said we should go down and meet and meet him the uh, he, he took this photograph or or i assume he took it anyway but we could actually go to the place Beautiful. where this photograph was taken mm -hmm. and it's a it's a sign isn't it it's a yeah a tin sign so yeah. that's that's pretty cool so that's Super our cool. bungle on tour uh sign now this is cool. This is, these these are cool. So these are extensions to our mat. Can we can we zoom out anymore? Or is that's probably about as far as we can go. So they're like little mouse mats, and the the they are small versions of our of our coin mat. Oh, you'll notice as well, it's a new coin mat. We got uh, we got oh, replacement yes. replacement coin coin mat for our dirty one. So we've got a couple of them. This uh, so this is an extension. So has he as uh, Mark said that if we get if our mat gets full, then we can pull out the the, the mini mat. So we've got two. So I don't think we're getting them in shot. But what Lady M said is they could make really cool travel mats. Yeah. So you still got to, if we were doing a hunt whilst we were on the road or maybe while we're on tour, there's enough space for the 2017 uh, Potter set. Mm -hmm. We've still got Paddington Corner and there's also a corner now for the plum finds as well. So they're absolutely cool. So they're like little mouse mats, aren't yeah. they? Awesome. So they're absolutely brilliant. We've got uh, two of them. And I think the, the piece de resistance, oh, I am a, yeah. I'm a big fan of money boxes. So you got a sneak preview of this during the during the first part of the live stream, I think, because this was on the on yeah. the corner. It was kind of kind of here. So this is a this is a porcelain money box. I like money boxes and a bit more about money boxes at the uh, towards the end of the of the episode because I've got some fantastic money boxes to show you. So we've got the plum finds there on the side. We've got the Benjamin bunnies with a stamped B. So clearly Mark knows where it's at. <laughs> he knows where the most desirable mm -hmm. coin is. There we go. So that's a picture of the the stamped B. The rarest. Got the bungle logo on there saying that we should watch it the got the rules for the channel so the rules shall always change and the winner shall be bungle so absolutely <laughs> he knows the score there we do the prize draw so sunday prize draw winner he's got that on there got subscribe like and of course we've got the cocktail stick so this i'm sure this will be available to buy as well i was talk, talking to total coins because total coins got one and i think he said they were are they eight quid yeah um, i think so yeah, yeah eight quid so if you're interested in your own bungle collects money box then then mark is selling them on his web, oh, yeah. website www.raftree.co.uk and the link will be in the description below like yeah. it is in all of our videos Super so cool, yeah fantastic uh, really appreciate that mark and Absolutely everyone at raftree it. for producing uh, that for us right we're not done there we got uh, we got this off alex blondin so alex has his own instagram page and what alex did is he commissioned this special benjamin bunny to be inscribed with rodney so the benjamin's gone and rodney is now here it's a normal 2017 50p as you can as you can see so it was dan temple so anybody who knows well everybody knows who dan temple is the legend that is dan temple he commissioned dan and dan has put rodney on there so that's a, an in joke so christopher 
I think he, I think he initially got the names wrong. He called him Rod, Rod, Rodney or yeah, I think Roger, he just Roger Bannister, wasn't it? It was yeah. Roger Bannister and Rooney Bunny, Rodney yeah. Bunny, this, that, and the other. So Rodney Bunny is the is the in joke. So fantastic craftsmanship from Dan Temple yeah. and very th big thanks to Alex Blondin for giving Lady M and I one of them. We will certainly treasure that one. I am sure. We've got a very quick look at this. We did some adventure golf. If you have a look on Christopher's uh, upload for his Royal Mint trip, yep. you'll see that we did some adventure adventure golf. We went round with uh, there's there's the scores. I'll let you have a look to see if you can work out who the uh, who the winner was there. Very close. So there was me and Lady M. There was Trev from Coins to Collect, and there was Dan, so Master Temple, and his son Ben as well. So we had a great uh, we had a great time. So we can recommend that golf, can't we? Certainly yeah, recommend. Superb recommend that so i mentioned trev there so trev gave us a load of coins that he got from gibraltar and hopefully these are all full of animals because i told him that I quite like an animal on a coin and ellie certainly likes animals on the coin so let's have a little look at what he's what he brought us back from gibraltar looks that looks like a, a five pence there we go we've got a we got a little monkey on there are the apes rather than the monkeys barbary apes I are they, are they, they all are. barbary 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 i think, I think so barbary apes i don't know so there's a there's a lovely 5p. There's another 5p. Oh, I wonder whether he doubled up. He got one for us and one for Ellie. Not sure. Maybe. So there is a, another 5 pence. So new Calpay House, Norfolk Square. So I'm sure these I'm sure these come on. They do this on the 5p's, the 10p's, 50p's, yeah, pounds. Yeah, I think there's a variety. I'm sure there's, isn't a, there? there's a series of it. That's We've in, definitely got a 50p with Calpay House on. Really nice condition. Yeah, 2018. Oh, there we go. Oh, There's the penny version. Another 2018. I, I assume they're all 2018. I wonder if they did a set. There's a Gibraltarian 20 pence with some flowers on or thistles. I'm not sure exactly what they are. Mm. Territories are not my strong point. So here's the pound. So this is discovery of Neanderthal skull in Gibraltar, 1848. So it's the skull, the Neanderthal skull. Fabulous. So Gibraltar still used the round pound. Did you know that, Lady M? Uh, only because I watched Trev's <laughs> yeah. um, Gibraltar video. Yeah, that's the only reason why. Fabulous. I, that's the only reason why I know it as well. And if you haven't watched that, you know, do go over and uh, and have a and give it a a view because it's a brilliant video. It certainly is. So Trev from Coins collected a like a travel vlog yeah. when he went to Gibraltar. The sec I haven't seen it yet, but the second episode's uploaded oh, as well. Excellent, have to watch that. So definitely worth a worth a look there. Yeah, there we go. Two Barbary apes. Cool. Trev also did a channel takeover. So he's done a he's done an episode of Bungle Collects. So look out for that in the future, along with Total Coins as well. That's in good nick. It is very good nick. What year is that? 2018, yeah, there must there must have been a set. I think, yeah. Maybe, yeah. So yeah, keep your eye out for coins to collect and total coins who've done a channel takeover of Bungle Collects. They'll be up over the next few weeks. That's a tree, isn't it? I wonder whether Trev ever. I haven't seen his video. Did, no. did he find so that tree in Gibraltar? Let's not spoil it, and we'll have to watch the video and find yeah. out. I don't know. I can't spoil it. I don't know. There is the Great Siege. So the massive gun. We found one of them in a previous coin hunt, mm -hmm. 2011. Amazing. He's done well here, hasn't he, for yeah, us? Yeah, superb. And there's the 50p version of New Calpe House. Am I pronouncing that right, Lady? I'm Calpe, C-A-L-P-E. I think so, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's how I'd say I think I heard Christopher say it. That's why I had done oh, it. Right. So we've got the Elizabeth DG Regina there for Gibraltar. We won't go into that too Let, much. Let's not. Uh, we know it's a defender <laughs> of the faith. And she reigns, but we won't say, <laughs> we won't say any more about that. <laughs> there is a, There it is. The pound version. I think we've got everything except a, a two pence, haven't we? Uh, yeah. Ah, I love that partridge. Oh, nice. Lovely. Nice little Allen coin there, 2016. <laughs> so, yeah, I think if anyone's got a 2p, a 2p Calpe house. 2p. 2p. 2p Calpe house. Please do send it to the PO box. That'll be great. I'm yeah. sure the link will be in the, uh, or the, the details will be in the description below. So, we've got. A penny, so we haven't got a 2p, got a 5p, got a 10p, 10p. didn't we? That's a 10p. Oh, no, we didn't. Oh, we didn't get it. We haven't got a 10p, no. so we need a 10p as well. But we've got the 20p and the and 50p the and the pound. No two pound coin either. Mm, yeah. Did they do a two pound? Not there. Uh, I think Trev said that they were really nowhere 
had a stock of two pounds because they don't use them very no, often. I wonder whether they actually did one though, or did the mint one? Yeah. So we got six ten p's an hour change. Hang on, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh no, we got seven. <laughs> I don't know how I managed to get seven. This is just in one transaction. <laughs> So that, uh, and because all I did was pay for our strike your own, so I'm not quite sure. Very, very generous on that one, probably for me a mistake. So we've got two L's, I believe. Looks like you have three L's there. Oh, oh no, it's an L. Is it an L? Oh no, it's an L, yeah. yeah. An L? So we've got three L's. We didn't get the M, we actually swapped this M for a D that we had with, I'm sure it was with Raftree. Okay. I think, because he wanted, he had a D. He didn't have a D, but he had two M's, so we swapped it for that D. I like the D. Yeah, you do, yeah, you did. It. I know you mentioned that. And then we got two X's as well. So we did okay. really well. They got all that in one change. You don't normally get that many in, no. a, in a go, in one go. They'll all be 2018s. So no, we, we just did, make didn't get sure. much chance to do anything. No, it we wasn't. We didn't buy any postcards. It was, it was, we didn't do anything. Nothing. It was so manic. We did it the was. tour. We didn't stay and look through the museum. We went straight through to get set up for the live stream. Massive thanks again to Total Coins for being our technical support yeah. and getting us set up as well. So yeah, we went straight through to the to the live stream and then we did it all the way till half past four and we packed up and then off we went. So we didn't buy anything in the gift shop other than pay for the strike your owns. Yeah. So we did uh, we did really, really well there. Uh, is that it, Lady M? Have we got anything else to go through? So anything small? Yeah, well I'll, I'll go through because what I'm gonna have to do, we've still got two we've got three packages that I need to to show you. But two of them I need to zoom right out because they're really big. One from Jamesy e. B. Hoy and another one from Coins to Collect and Trev. And then, of course, we've got the Peace de Resistance, which is Master Temple's mm. package. Can't wait to open, no, open super that. Super excited. So what I'll do, I'll have to just sign off here and then just, well, not sign off, but hang hang on in about three minutes' time. You'll see the, I'll have to well, lift the camera up. I don't think do it'll it. be three oh, minutes. Three then. seconds' time, okay. <laughs> Why don't I do the click? Let's do the yeah. click. Does So I'll do the click and then all this will be clear and we'll be ready to see Master Temple's package. And uh, <laughs> and then the big boxes. Are we ready? Okay, here it is. The package that we've all been waiting for. Can't wait to uh, get into this, Lady M. I've already seen a couple of other coin tubers videos with a, f with a few little spoilers, so I'm even more excited. Yeah. So, thank you very much to the legend that is Dan Temple, Martha wow. Temple. At I would uh, I would rather be collecting on Instagram, and he's done it again, hasn't he? Absolutely Abs phenomenal. How on earth does he do that? He seriously needs to do videos and film himself of how he does it. Yeah, just just painting it. Yeah. It's absolutely fantastic. So this will be on a, another Stunning. Royal Mint postcard. So there's Delilah on the top of the hill. Sorry about the rain in the Bungle Collects Magic Studio. It is teeming down. So let's have a little bit of a zoom in there. Abs I'm just blown away, you. Yeah. So hi, Bungle, Lady M, all the best. Happy days, Dan. Absolutely, awesome. absolutely class. Thank you. I can't, I, Amazing. I've got. I, I'm nothing. I can't say anything. I've got nothing else to say. I'm lost for words. Oh, oh my, my word! word. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, and he's got one. Oh. He's done it, Ellie. One. Oh. Wow. So this is. So this is the one I've seen other coin tubers um, have. So it's a token. He's made 25, we've got number eight. So it's got the mint on and the, and the dates for the mint meet up. So let's have a look at, at that one first. Fancy him getting any one, how kind. So there it is, have I just ripped that? Oh, oh yeah. sorry. Damn it, Whoops. never mind. Never mind, I'll probably take it out anyway and handle <laughs> and <touch> it. it. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, the mint, absolutely fantastic. Happy days, Dan. Thank you. So yeah, twenty five of these in circulation. Absolutely We've got number eight. Absolutely awesome. Stunning. Absolutely stunning. So I'm looking at Ellie's, and I'll try and be a little bit more yeah. careful with Ellie's, if I possibly can. Trust me to rip that other one. So there we go, Ellie twenty twenty. It's even got all the markings on the side. All like the best, Dan. Coin. Oh, it has. Yeah. Yeah, so it's like the uh, like a pound coin, like a pound coin, like the round pound. Awesome. The detail is just stunning, isn't it? Absolutely Such amazing. A talent. How kind, how kind of you. If she were Ellie, will be over the moon with that. Yeah. Right, so we've got the Lady M. We've got a bungle ball. Does that say? Yeah. Bungle ball and the Lady M undersize error. <laughs> Never been called that before, have you? <laughs> An no. undersize error. Right, should we do <laughs> ladies? Ladies first. Okay. Let's go. Do you, do you want to unpack it? Is it yours? Uh, yeah, go on then. 
There you go, Lady Thank M. You. Oh my word. Look at that. That is absolutely class. I love it. Amazing. So it's the 2020. I'll have to, so I'll have I'll to get the, the, cameras, see. the cameras so high up and neither of us can see it because we're ready for. We've got a big box to show next, so we needed to be out. Not yet. So, thanks. All the best, Dan Temple. Amazing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> let's get ready to bungle 2020. Awesome. <laughs> so, we've got the, the superb the 20. So, we've already got the two, we got a 2019 mm -hmm. version last year, and now we've got the 2020 version. Amazing. Thank you, Dan. Class. Let's have a look then at my undersizing. <laughs> so it's a, it's a Diddy version. That is perfectly formed though. It is. It is. It's got, it's got let's get ready to bungle on I the know. other side. There, yeah. not around the outside. Yeah. And then it's got Lady M written around the outside. 7 3 2020. 20. Excellent. That is absolutely phenomenal. I'm bowled over. No, 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 hold it up. Look at that. Let's get ready to bungle. Yeah, I don't think that is undersized. No. I mean, maybe, think, maybe he thinks the middle's too big or something. Don't know. Or is it just small all round? I don't know. But that is, there's nothing wrong with that. Perfectly formed. Awesome. Absolutely amazing. Right, let's have a look at the let's have a look at the bungle ball. Bungle ball. <laughs> what can it be? Oh, it's a co it says cocktail stick ball. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow! I can't wait to see what this is. Oh, how this looks. <laughs> the bungle ball. I don't think they're helping. No, I don't think they are, though. <laughs> 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 oh, that is phenomenal. Let's get ready to bungle. There is, that is the, that must be Bungle Bear there, oh, the bear on. I say, Dad and I have this thing where we, if we message each other all, uh, on the comment, I always put... The little taekwondo, judo, karate emoji, and uh, Dan always puts the bear emoji. That's that all kind of little code to each other. But mm. absolutely amazing. Yeah, Never seen anything like that. It's beveled in, isn't it? Yeah. That is absolutely phenomenal. So perfect for <laughs> <laughs> perfect for the cocktail oh. stick. Let's have, a, <laughs> let's have a look, because I will have one right here. That is amazing. Absolutely, that is one of a kind. Superb. <laughs> you just rest across like that. Is that the idea? Yeah. <laughs> so it's ready. It's always ready at a moment's notice. It's ready to bungle. Ready, ready to wear. Uh, ready to point. Fabulous, Dan. You're an absolute legend. Superb. You really are. Thank you so so much for for everything. I'm uh, overwhelmed. Can't wait to show Ellie that. And yeah, oh man, I, d I don't know what to say to you. No. No, thanks Dan. Genius. Thanks, thanks mate. Right, okay, so let's get on to the big boys. So we've got a package from Jamesy B. Hoy. So Jamesy boy is quite new to the coin tuber scene. We, we met him down at the Royal Mint. He's an absolute scream. And he gave us this survival package. If you like, so he said it was a Scottish survival package. So whether you can see, it's in a big, it's in a big box. And he said that we needed to open it, so we couldn't wait to to film. We'd have to open it because there might be perishables inside. Right, more about that in a minute. So the letter says, "Bungle and Lady M, thanks so much for the laughs and making me feel so welcome on your live streams. That's our pleasure, and in the community. Here's a little Scottish treat for you guys as as a thank you from Wide Boy Jamesy. So. We did say we weren't going to open this until the till the video, but unfortunately we couldn't we couldn't resist. 
So there's a whole range of Scottish snacks. Snack attack. But unfortunately, they've pretty much all been devoured. So the uh, the caramel with wafers have, uh, have gone. Yeah. There is one caramel log left, which I never I never put anything like this in my mouth before, do you? <laughs> It was a it was a taste sensation. It was. So there there is there is one left, and it's probably up to Lady M to eat that one because I've had enough. I've had enough of these. Excellent. Um, I've had no, I haven't had enough. I've had more than my fair share of caramel logs. So yeah, these are anyone I think south of the border well, wouldn't expect a roasted coconut covered caramel wafer biscuit. Yeah. But uh, yeah, I've never seen them ones before. No. Definitely not. That was class. So oh. yeah, I'm afraid we'd eaten all but one. Uh, I've completely eaten all of the yeah. tea cakes, I'm afraid. Uh, I've got one. They're also uh, gone. Sorry about that. Uh, <laughs> there is half a packet of shortbread left. Oh, well, so that's you'll, okay. you'll, be pleased with, you'll be pleased with that. So there is half a packet, but the rest has been has Do been eaten. Would. Other things in the box was there was there was this. And again, I'm afraid it's been it's it's been drunk. Lady M has not sampled this yet, but no. I have brought you a little glass, Lady oh, M. Right, thank you. So you can have a little a little Excellent. tipple of this. I shall have a drink now. So it's Iron Brew, old and unimproved. So I've had a read of the bottle, and basically it's saying it's the original 1901 recipe for Iron Brew. Awesome. So quite like Iron Brew. I don't think I can have too much of it really because it's full of sugar. So I tend to try and drink things that haven't got too much sugar in. An invigorating, refreshing tonic beverage. The original non, -gen the original non genuine without the signature copyright. Wow. Excellent. Yeah, is it but yeah bar is it bar that make it? Yeah, yeah. bar. There's the information on the on the back. Iron brew, 1901. Taste the first ever iron brew recipe, brewed just like we're used to in 1901. Made from girders, it's brilliantly sweet and caffeine free with a cheeky wee head on it. Head on it, cheeky wee heed, heed on it. But it's still that taste you can't describe because there's nothing like it. Not back then, not now, not ever. Caffeine free, I didn't know that. Well, there you go. I wonder where the, the, the newer version is. So, I'll do you a little little nip of this, Lady M. I did take oh. it, oh dear. Busy. I did take it to work with me today and sampled it and I let the post office raider have a little try because he's always looking for the next taste sensation. So there you go, Lady M. Right. Original, old and unimproved. Bottoms up. Just like the iron brew. She never noticed that. Never noticed what? What I said. Old and unimproved. Oh, just like me. No, I said just like the iron and brew. What do you think? Uh, yeah. I hope you haven't got cooties. I've just used the same glasses as you. No, you don't use the same glasses as me. So, anyway, so a fantastic, lovely Scottish uh, survival kit. Also in there was three coins because we won Jamesy Boys' giveaway. I think this is just was just an extra. I don't think that this was part of the giveaway, but I guess he stuck that in because it's the Scottish Thistle from 1986. I do like the old, old two pound coins. I still need the uh, the bill of rights. No, I don't. I still need the claim of rights. So if anyone's got a spare claim of rights that wants to sell me at a good price, let me know. So I need that to complete my collection. So thank you very much, uh, Jamesy B Hoy, for that. And sorry these were about the rain. Again. Yeah, sorry about the rain. <laughs> these were definitely part of the giveaway. So James, he's got his own channel. Go over and check him out. He's definitely unique. Definitely something that you won't have uh, seen before. I have no doubt. So we've got the the big 1977 coronation coin, 25 pence, I think it was. Five pounds coin replaced it. Lovely. And then we also got this cricket coin. First one I've got of the cricket coins. Yeah. Oh, the, although there's a set, was the five? Not quite sure. No, not so they are a wonderful addition to our coin collection. Thank you very much, Jamesy B. Hoy. Right, last but not least, let's. Uh, Trev knows I have a little bit of a thing for money boxes. I suppose I'll collect absolutely anything, to be honest with you. Badges, hats, scarves. Badges? Did you no. say badges then? No, badges. <laughs> I don't need no stinking badges. <laughs> so I'll collect just about uh... anything, but one of my passions. Uh, is, is passion the right word? I don't know. One of my quirks. Obsessions. Well, I think obsessions is too big a, uh, too big a word for it. But oh, okay. it's money boxes. So Trev knows this. He did. He did kindly send us a chip. Mm -hmm. Don't know whether anyone remembers chip. Hamper. We put it back together in our live streams. It got smashed when it got delivered. 
Uh -huh. And what he said was he was able to clear out of his own money, money boxes and he thinks that I'm the absolute ideal person <coughs> to have his old selection. So here they are. We've got an absolute stack of them. We've got interest in this lady. Um, Ellie was saying that we have the... Ellie, Ellie bought me the other one of this the other the other week oh did she there, there it is there look on the other side oh, right, okay so this whatever this is now wall yeah we've got the yeah. is it the boy version i'm not sure okay, whether okay so yeah i think ellie bought you the boy version that definitely will fit the girl version with the rainbow hair so we've accidentally completed a mini set wow <laughs> we've got um big ben or elizabeth tower as it is big ben is technically the the bell inside okay we've got a mini bungle bear I don't think it's an official bungle bear. Have you seen these, Lady M? Not all of them, no. no. And a fish <laughs> as well. And uh, can we, we'll have to move these Just to one. More. Yeah, we'll have to move these to one side, I think, so we get the next lot out. <laughs> Got Just Keep Saving. Oh, cool. Instead of Just Keep Swimming. Cupcake. Another bear. Maybe bear. Got the stick. Got the stick. I reckon this is Dusty Bin. I was just going to say, is that Dusty Bin? Yeah. That's cool. I think it's Dusty Bin. Does it say? No. No. No, I think it's a shady Dusty Bin. Oh, wait. Right. Knock off. Knock off Dusty Bin. <laughs> Pigs. I do. I am a big fan of uh, piggy bank pigs. Okay, we'll have to move these out, and then wow. we'll get the last, uh, the last few. So as if I didn't have enough already, we've now got a absolute total stack of them. So the last few, we've got uh, this house. Best way to describe it, I guess. We've got a football. The football that I'm still not probably the only football I'll ever find on this channel. <laughs> yeah. We've certainly never found Olympic football. We've got Aww, we've got this cute. little cute pig. And for any LFC fans, we've got a LFC piggy bank as well. So I'm sure Absolute Coins would uh, would like that. He'd be very jealous that I've got that one. Uh, have you got a favourite Lady M? Oh. Out of them, how many got? One, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. There must be 20 money boxes there. Have like, you got a favourite? I think the bear with the red bow tie. Right, hang on. Let's get the, let's get the bear on shore then. Do you have a thing for bears? Uh, a little bit. I wonder if anybody knows what I'm currently wearing. <laughs> well, nobody would I know. I think it's a, a bungle bear outfit. <laughs> yeah, no one knows what I'm currently wearing, but yeah, certainly... Look like a full bear today. I like Dusty Bin as well. Dusty Bin's going to have to get an honourable mention. So plum finds. Careful. We've got, we've got the bear. We've got the LFC one and an honourable mention to Dusty Bin. Can we? Yeah, we'll have to show the mini set as well, Lady M. Can you? Can you reach that now, Wall? Okay. We'll have to do a. Nothing would be complete. Well, it wouldn't be complete if we couldn't do a mini set. So where's the where's it gone? So this is the now wall that Trev gave us here, and Ellie just happened to have bought me this. Do you want to show show the cactus as well, okay. or cacti? So Ellie bought me this just a couple of weeks ago. It had just been cheap. I'm sure we're like from home bargains or something like that. So we happened to have found a found a mini set. Should and we'll have just, some money burning um, a hole in a pocket. Yeah, and we'll just have a just a just a cactus there just for 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 the why nots. Right, I think that's it, Lady M. I do, I is, think it, that is it is enough? Is it that is enough? So oh, let's just do a quick shout out to the people that we met. Oh, this is going to be a good test oh, of the memory. Wow. So hello to Alana, Rosa, yeah. Bay, yeah. Callum. Yeah. Anybody, any other, any other Kitty Winkles? Oliver. Oliver, of course, yeah, that we mentioned from Coins and More UK. Was that, was that all the Kitty Winkles? I hope so. Sorry if I missed anybody out. My memory's not great. And who else, who else uh, hunted with us? So Raff Tree did, Laughter. Uh, Steve Ufton, Dan, the legend that is Dan Temple, uh, Womble Alley, Steve from Leicester, 
Who else was there? I should have wrote this down, Sean. I believe. Did the hunt always just there? Did the hunt? No, did the hunt. Purple fairy, of course. Yeah. Did anybody else? It was really, it was really kind of people that chose to hunt with me as well. That was, I was really, 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 really pleased with that. Yeah, can't, and I hope I haven't, uh, hope I haven't forgotten anybody. So, and if I have forgotten anybody, then do, go back and watch the live stream and see who it was and let me know who it yeah. is that who I've, I've, I've missed. So, I need to do a massive shout out to Millie One Twenty. So we yeah. met Millie One Twenty and and. Uh, and her other half, so that's uh, AKA Mr. and Mrs. Beaver. And I think the <laughs> biggest thank you has got to be to Judas, hasn't it? So Judas was an absolute legend. We met awesome. her for the first time. We, we give her a prize that she'd won on a, on a giveaway on one of our previous 10p hunts. She very kindly guarded the table she for did. us that we live streamed from when we went on the coin hunt. She was an absolute pleasure all day. People wanted to talk to her. Yeah. Lovely lady, absolutely Super. amazing. Hope to uh, see you again, Judas. No two ways about it. Yeah, was a, right, we're definitely done now. Thank you, everybody who came down to the Royal Mint. It was a fantastic to do the live stream. Big, massive shout out. Thank you so much for the people that give us things. Yeah. Please don't, obviously, if people, please, if, you see, if people come down again, don't feel obliged to give us anything. No. Uh, you really don't have to, but we are amazingly touched for, for everything, that, uh, everything that you've done for us. One last look at Mr. Temple's uh, card, I think. We'll, we'll, we'll sign off there. Yeah. Right, thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next episode. Hang on, I just found the uh, I just found the the last prize of James E B Hoy's giveaway. So it was this fantastic uh, fifty cents from Australia. It's in the bottom of the box, part of the giveaway. Thanks, Jamesy.